Hello everybody and welcome to the third part in uh, SOLIDWORKS to making uh, chair let's start by uh, new file the top plan and that's I think the the easiest part to make we have 280 here using a shared bus with 18 and we'll fill it here with 12 you can just use appearance with the wood where is the wood is here choose whatever you want okay and uh, no and save your file part 4 okay and uh, you can just go to file make assembly form part and uh, click keep visible start by the fourth one and the third the second part and the first part now we have not uh, done our work but it's just to see how we can uh, make an assembly you have to switch this like this and choose this one But if you want to don't make all this, you can just add the circle. It's the easiest way. Make 280. And from here to this one, we have 80. And add the relation, make vertical can just construct geometry validate and save your file and now go to assembly clicking mate select this one this one and we have a relation but it's just for making for not for not to uh, leave this point turn out choose the third part and make it uh, parallel okay and now let's see, fix it and add a relation between these from here to this hole click OK and in the part the part 4 the right plan of the part 4 and uh, this is the part one choose the part one here the right plan of the part one it's not the part one this one is this the part one the right plan then click ok it's the same thing to this one choose this hole with this and to make it in the center use the right plan of the of the this uh, the seat or this part 
and the right plan of this part click OK and now we have this but but to fix this in this position I marked in the real uh, chair we have a translation here with the uh, tangents then let's make tangent here with this one and this okay but the last uh, problem here is this one can cross this uh, sheet metal. To fix that I had to add uh, I had to add uh, advanced mates with two plans. The first plan is from the part two the top choose the top and go to the part one choose the top plan again but before to choosing the top plan click uh, in the angle choose now the top plan and what you have uh, to put here we have 60 degrees I calculate this in the and uh, the minimum value okay the minimum value is zero now you can just see if the two plans make zero degrees and we have and we have the the minimum and the maximum value that's the maximum with 60 degrees and we have the minimum the maximum is 60 degrees the minimum is 0 degree okay but we have uh, a nice problem here I don't know why but you can just put the minimum like uh, 10 and now when we when we arrive to this let's stop it let's try with 5 degree okay let's just touch a little let's try with the 7 okay now with 6 I think it's okay okay when, when we put 6 degrees here, it's the maximum, it can't uh, touch the sheet metal. It's the same thing here, you can just add uh, 62 or uh, 62 here, or 61. okay that's the maximum then uh, validate from here your work and uh, save your work uh, build you can build tell yes and in the same folder you can just put uh, name whatever you want here and save it uh, in the next tutorial we will make all these uh, components here and use the mirror component to make the same thing in this section to this side and we will use the toolbox here the toolbox to put uh, screw and uh, port here and we will uh, use the uh, the whole
featured wizard to make haul in this assembly then thank you for watching see you in the next tutorial to see all what uh, i'm going to talk about thank you and uh, if you like it you can just uh, subscribe